Based on some feedback I got in the comments of my last video, for the past week I've been trying to upgrade this bot to be able to protect itself better. This is probably quite important for a guard bot, to be able to protect itself so that it can in fact protect other players. The first change I made is that now when the bot is scanning for a boss player to protect, it'll no longer just stand around and get killed by enemies. It'll also react to them now. It'll now kill any enemies that get too close to it while it's scanning for a boss player. I now made it so the bot can register players as threats as well. A player will be considered a threat either if they're in the target list file or if they hit the bot or the player that it's currently protecting. This excludes any players in the boss list um, because we're giving them special permission. Another change I made is I added an equip armor command that allows you to make the bot equip armor. It'll scan through its inventory and equip the best armor it has for a specific slot. So starting with netherite, then diamond, iron. Um, I'm not entirely sure where gold fits into this, but for now I just have it here. And then another command I've added is the eat command, which allows you to force the bot to eat. Because the way that I had it before, uh, when the bot got hungry, you would have no way to make it eat. So it'd end up not being able to like sprint and keep up with you. And eventually it would just starve to death, um, which is not ideal and it's very annoying. It's not very useful like that. And then I've also added an auto-eating ability. So the bots have a variable called hunger limit. So when the bot's hunger reaches below that limit, it'll automatically eat some food. I'll probably add a command so you can toggle this on or off. I understand that like you might not want the bot to eat the food that it's carrying for whatever reason. And I also actually added it so the bot can automatically equip armor. It should do this whenever it picks up a new item. It should probably actually be just evaluating the item that it picks up and seeing if it's better than the armor it's already wearing. That'd be a lot more efficient, but currently I just have it so it's re-equipping the entire set of armor. Which isn't too slow anyway, so it doesn't really matter, but I'd like to fix that eventually. Another thing that was wrong with the bot is that when you were commanding it in Minecraft, you'd be doing it in the public chat so everyone can see what you're telling the bot. Which isn't ideal. So I've added support for whisper messages, so when you talk to the bot using the slash tell command in Minecraft, the bot now registers that and it can pick up on it. It can follow those commands. And when it's giving feedback or when it's responding to those commands, it'll reply with whispers as well. There's a link in the description to the code on GitHub. Consider giving this video a like and subscribing if you haven't already. My next video should hopefully be out in a week or two. Thanks for watching.